You may have seen my video over on Black Belt Secrets about Keir Starmer getting all excited about AI. Well, I think I understand why, and it's a little bit more alarming than you might first think. Now, whilst my video on Secrets was a little bit more entertaining, this one is a little bit more serious. First of all, if you're new to me, I'm Daniel Shensmith, a barrister of England and Wales, and I'm bringing you, I hope, really important information that affects you directly, the whole of the population, um, and these are things that you might otherwise miss, so please do subscribe to the channel. Um, but this is about, uh, yes, the use of AI, but also the use of your data, your personal medical data. Now, I've had emails from uh, people who will remain anonymous because I will maintain their uh, confidentiality, um, who have told me a lot about the background to this, and with a little bit of research later and a few bits and pieces here and there, you can probably piece this together. Now, the Times reports that tech firms can mine NHS archives in a bit to fuel this AI revolution. Now, you'll see the bit that I've highlighted here that says um, anonymize. Now, this is plans under Keir Starmer um, to make the archives of scans, biodata, and anonymized patient records available for the first time to uh, train the latest AI models. Now, you might remember when was it some time ago, um, I did a video or a couple of videos on NHS data sharing way back in 2021. You had to opt out of your data being shared. Now, this opt out um, was a process because you were opted in unless you opted out. So your data was shared unless you opted out of the scheme. And so your data would be shared. Now, this was under this bit here, the general practice data for planning and research. Um, this was your data being used to assist the NHS and research and all this sort of stuff. And as I said, you had the op option to opt out. But there's something you may not be aware of, and it comes back to this use of data for AI purposes and training. And this is under what they call a Trusted Research Environment Service for England. Now, as you can see here, this service provides, as it says, secure platform with analytical and statistical tools to support researchers in conducting their work, finding can ex exported secure, uh, safely, ensuring the formats and analyses are approved and sent for authorized users. But what this does is provide access to data, medical data, and we're talking sensitive data here, not just anonymized or pseudonymized, which is where it's sort of given a unique reference. You can get back to the original, but not easily. Um, so neither anonymized or pseudonymized, some of this is actually sensitive data. Um, and what they do, they say we assess each request for using NHS digital uh, disclosure control rules in accordance with the safe output policy where the output is, an, is um, analysis results developed using personal sensitive and confidential data. So in short, whilst Keir Starmer is jumping up and down, getting all excited about the use of AI, more about what I think about that on my secrets video, I'll link that below. Um, this is really something I think we ought to be a little bit concerned about because your medical data being used for research, it's a double edged sword. On the one hand, I know medical professionals have said that the use of medical data is absolutely critical for uh, research and using AI to help combat diseases and find cures and all sorts of other things. But at the same time, if it's your data, you really need to have the choice about it. And you need to understand how your data is being used, where it's being used, authorized by, and so on. So I'll link these pages below. This video is not the definitive word on all of this. This is really to alert you to it because I've not yet finished the reading and the research. I've had quite a bit of interesting information from people that have emailed me directly. But I wanted to do this video just to alert you to this fact that when you see this in the news of being excited about AI and so on. This is what it's for, I think. This is where, where it's all governed, because data is valuable. Data is worth big money. So more videos to come on this. When I learn more about it, I'll link these below. Go and check them out. But for a slightly lighter hearted version of this, go and check out my Black Belt Secrets. I'll link that below as well. Um, but if you want more updates on this, please do like the video. Please do subscribe to the channel. Please do share this with somebody that probably doesn't know about it because I am not the mainstream media. I'm not controlled by the mainstream media. I'm not controlled by anybody. I am just a guy, a barrister, uh, researching this stuff, bringing it to your attention because I feel you need to know. So for that, please do subscribe and I'll see you next time.